Good evening, I'm Nick Kuzma. After winning their first game of the season a week ago, the Alabama a and Bulldogs look to build off that performance today at Lewis Cruz Stadium. a and welcomed Hugh Jackson and Grambling State to the Rocket City this afternoon. Both teams entered the game at 1-4. and four. Final seconds of the first quarter winding down. Tigers up 3 and Donovan Eaglin is off to the races for Alabama a and 26-yard touchdown. Bulldogs lead 7-3, to three, but Grambling would be up at halftime as Quintarius Hawkins hits Lyndon rush right on the numbers 10 7 Grambling State after two quarters of play fast forward now all the way to the fourth quarter the game is tied up at 17 Quincy Casey gets it to Terrell Gardner on the screen pass 23 yards down to the Grambling four but the Bulldogs yeah they're going to take advantage Harold Jemison plunges into the end zone for the short touchdown and I'm up 24 to 17 and now have the chance to win the game but the Tigers go on a 10 play 71 yard drive tied the game with 29 seconds left Maury Washington was the one to score and we are going to overtime both teams find the end zone to start things off so we're going to double OT and AM going to score again. Donovan Eaglin with the touchdown. Bulldogs go for two, but it wasn't successful. A stop is going to end things here. And on fourth down, the Bulldogs need a hero. And he comes in the form of Trey Derry. He gets the sack. Alabama AM wins 37 31. After starting 0 4, the Bulldogs are now 2 4. I got to take my hats off to uh, Grambling and Hugh Jackson. They team, the effort, they fight. Uh, you know, they back us up against the wall, uh, and uh, they fought us two for nail, like the championship was on the line. And then I, I got to credit my coaches, my offense and defense coordinator, having a great plan, and then the players for executing. At the end of the day, they executed. We made one more play than they did.